Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to our channel and yes, uh, we are starting up with our Java series and before you know starting our series, I would like to say that in this series guys, we will be trying to cover 1000 plus interview questions. Now point number two, in this series, whatever videos and whatever the questions we use it are from our Java full stack development course. So currently batch one is going on and if you're interested to enroll for our upcoming batch two. Uh, please feel free to ping me on Instagram and demand for a free session. Surely we will be connected with you. Okay. And uh, coming to the point number three, uh, in this series, guys, what I wanna do is I will be listing all these important questions, and later we will be having a proper discussion on those questions. Okay. So instead of you know focusing on the definition part, we will be focusing on understanding the concept. Okay. So trust me, if you know the concept properly, you can define your own definition by yourself. Okay, that is our main intention. So guys, our intention is not to give you the predefined definition so that you can add those questions and uh, speak in front of panelists. No, we won't be doing that. So our intention is to provide the conceptual explanation so that you understand the concept and speak your understanding in front of panelists. Okay, trust me, when you are in the interview, panelists won't be satisfied with your definition, guys. Trust me. So even though you are giving the definition, they will to check your understanding so here we will be focusing on understanding the concept and based upon that you can prepare yourself okay all right guys uh, so these are the questions which we're gonna cover in this uh, session uh literal related questions okay so first is what is literal give example for literal how to declare literal rules for literal and uh, uh, at last we'll be looking into its syntax part Okay, so if you need uh, these questions for your reference, you can just take a screenshot. So now we'll be having a conceptual explanation. Concept. What is the concept which is left? Literals. So literal C, what is mean by literal? Anyone having any idea? Guys, anyone is having any idea about what is literal? Yeah, I think it's a constant assigned to a variable. Constant? What constant? Uh -huh. What type of constant it is? Yeah, it might be anything like it's integer or character or a string. Okay, yeah. Whatever uh, said by her, that is exactly correct. What is mean by literal? Literal means any constant value which can be assigned to a variable. Any constant value that can be assigned to a variable is called literal. So can anyone give one example? Chandana, could you please provide one example for literal? So any constant. So first thing that I, I want to store a integer variable like 2000 okay this is a constant see what is the int here data type data type, data type. okay what is this var variable variable what is this value constant constant not constant that is we call it as literal 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 this value we call it as literal okay because it is directly represent a integer value 200 because see any constant value that can be assigned to variable which variable we are assigning 200 literal. 2000 where where for this variable we are assigning so what we call it as this 2000 we call it as literal understood yeah Okay, now we have some rules to define this literals. Rules to define literals. In the same way, for variables also we have variables. So whenever you are defining your variables, what are the symbols is allowed is uh, as a first character. Suppose uh, uh, like uh, for variables also we have for variables, only dollar symbol is allowed. Only dollar symbol allowed. How that is, I will going to give one example. Suppose 
int where i am defining correct right this is the normal way of defining a variable so shall i define like int dollar variable yeah this is same as this one you can also define variables like this don't trust blindly i will going to show here no int where is equals to 10 int dollar num is equals to 20 i'm going to print where yes num hello dot java guys what is the okay guys what is the error i am getting here num was not declared num was not declared why i have already declared right num here in num not dollar num is the variable dollar num is a variable right so if i prefix so num and if i save this one and if i clear screen if i java c hello dot java did i get any error here so by this what what i can i can conclude this you can declare a variable with dollar num as well okay understood is it only in the front we can declare or anywhere i can declare suppose i am defining like this int num dollar is equals to 30 and i want to print the same here num dollar okay so ls and java c hello dot java so yeah okay sorry guys whatever i am telling whether you are able to understand that uh, any problem understood bro no problem anil ah bro understandable understandable right so yeah see you can declare in the prefix as dollar num or num dollar suffix same both are same you can declare okay and for variables shrinivas uh, we can use can we use in middle as a do dollar dollar okay let me check num mm, dollar m yeah, is it yeah so we cannot use that one actually oh. See, it will change okay. the meaning of the variable name itself correct right yeah 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 if you take this one yeah we'll we'll explore everything is an experiment guys if you are performing you will ex if you are exploring means you will learn lot lot of things hello dot java yeah okay no error if i am printing then 20 100 yeah you can declare yeah yeah sure mas yeah you can declare and okay, okay. for variables you can mention underscore and dollar these two variables are allowed like suppose if i am defining into where, where means you can declare into where this way also you can declare or you can declare where underscore or else you can declare underscore v underscore a r r v underscore a underscore r these are the possible two ways you can declare a variable guys okay understood yes yes yeah. yeah for for variables you can use dollar as well as the underscore okay now if you take literals what is literal literal is a constant value right what is int where is equals to 2000 so i am defining this one no suggestion this one guys 
whenever you are submitting any assignments please make sure that you are doing in any of ide you should mention you should provide screenshots of the output don't simply write the code and write the output in the below you should provide the screenshot then only i will able to understand that you guys are doing otherwise i will think that you guys are copying from somewhere else and you are just copy pasting that one and you are coming okay so i am getting if you are making this one if i am running i am getting 2000 output so are there any rules for this constant values also to define correct right guys hello yeah there are some rules for literals literals you have only underscore is available to define this literal guys literal means whether i should use underscore on the right hand side or left hand side both both should must you can use both this is variable but i am talking about literals forget about variables i am talking about literals so literal means whether i should use underscore on the right hand side or left hand side. literals guys in this one what is literal 2000 2000 is literal right so whenever i am doing some operation on literal means which side i should apply underscore right hand side only right i am defining rules for uh, literal means this is literal right so you can apply literal here so if i want to define 2000 means i should write in this way correct or not we'll we'll see output okay now java c hello dot java errors java hello yeah you can define in this way or you can also define 2000 underscore this is one of the syntax okay and you can also define each number two underscores as well two zero zero two underscores as well this is also valid syntax okay and you should not use like what is the what means you should not use single underscore like what means so if i am having this one if i prefix with underscore i'm controlling and java c hello dot you should not use up front you should not use on the front directly and in the similar way you should not use on the you should not suffix or you should not fix the var underscore only in the middle you have to use okay understood any doubt hello yeah no doubt yeah vinay no doubt no doubt so what are all the possibilities uh, for a literal what is the valid syntax should i use uh, uh, like uh, uh, when i can you please interact so i am defining a variable like 10000 and i am using underscore at the last is it valid syntax yeah valid syntax i am using at the end oh no no it is not a valid syntax you should not use at the end as well yeah. as in the front only yeah. you should use in the middle underscore yeah. this is only valid syntax understood yeah yeah so with that it will complete what is the rules of uh, literals